right, guys. That's a nice stocked whitefish from Simcoe there. So today's video blog, I'm going to be out catching whitefish. I'm going to show you clips from a couple the last couple days, and uh, that's a good way to start it. Oh boy, it's tangled in my other line out there. Over there? Yeah. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> Just open the bale if you don't mind. That's gonna be a mess. That's a big whitey, man. Oh, yeah. Crap. Yeah. Wow. That's a nice whitey. That's a nice white fish there. That's like a six pounder. Yeah. At least. I think I just got a whitey. <laughs> yeah, it did. That's in there good too. Nice. I need to drag him over. <laughs> That's my catch. <laughs>
I'm just getting off the water now. It's uh, Friday, January something, um, 20th maybe. I uh, had a really good day out there today. Good morning, I should say. The afternoon was pretty slow, but I landed, uh, I think 11 fish I landed. Lost another five or six more. Um, all white fish with the exception of one small laker um, that might have been a pound. Uh, it came off right in the hole. I probably would have taken that one home to fry, but uh, it's back she goes to get bigger. Maybe next time I catch her, she'll be a 20 pounder. Um, but yeah, fun week overall. My vacation's done. Uh, today was my last day. I'm back to work tomorrow. So I put in a lot of time on the water, uh, fishing for perch, uh, fishing for whitefish, fishing for lake trout unsuccessfully. Um, I'm still a little blown away by the lack of lake trout in the bay. Um, really didn't mark much bait at all. So, I mean, it makes sense. They gotta be where the food is, right? So if the food's out in the main lake, then that's where they're gonna be. Um, it's unfortunate I didn't get out there, but uh, mother nature is the way she is. and. She's got more in store for us. The forecast looks really warm coming up uh, for the next week almost. So today will be, I mean, I can't fish tomorrow anyways, but I wouldn't fish tomorrow. Uh, not on the deep water anyway. Um, there was about five inches of ice when I got off today at Johnson's Beach. And there was maybe two inches, an inch and a half of good ice left on the bottom. Everything else was really, really soft. I could literally take my boot and scrape down an inch, inch and a half into the ice. That's how soft it was getting on top. Uh, if you do venture out this week, um, I recommend you don't. But if you do, please be safe. Bring all your required gear. Go with a buddy. Don't go by yourself. Um, just be safe out there overall. So yeah, that's it. Uh, you said you saw a bunch of clips from the whitefish I got this week that I haven't shown already. And that's that. It's going to be a few more days before I get back out. So hopefully this will tie you over till then. And uh, that's it. As usual, guys, like, share, subscribe, do all that stuff. And I'll see you next time.